Hey there, Ospreys. I'm Bella Kasapow, bringing you a Russia-Ukraine news update on Inside Swoop in 90. First, the Associated Press reports that Russian forces give the nuclear power plant of Chernobyl back to the Ukrainians after Russian soldiers were exposed to high levels of radiation. Russian forces obtained the Chernobyl plant roughly one month ago. Although President Volodymyr Zelensky believes this is a military tactic the Russians are using to build stronger forces for new attacks in the southeast. In other news, AP reports that Ukrainian refugees seeking safety in Poland are encouraged to, join, to find jobs in healthcare or education. According to a UN report, the daily number of refugees fleeing Ukraine has decreased under 40,000, the lowest it's been since the Russian invasion. According to AP, the reason for the drop can be attributed to a lack of safe evacuations and reluctance to leave homes in an attempt to wait out the conflict. And finally, according to AP, peace talks to stop Russian attacks on Ukraine resume Friday in an attempt to help civilians trapped in Mariupol. Although Russian forces claim a Ukrainian airstrike on an oil depot and neighboring businesses caused fires and wounded two people. Russian troops have de-escalated forces around Kiev to promote tr trust between the two forces, though Ukrainian officials argue Moscow is regrouping for future attacks. Well, Ospreys, that's it for this Russia-Ukraine news update for Inside Super 90. I'm Bella Kasapow, and I'll see you next time.